I'm from the Philippines. I'm from Phoenix. Together, Together we're, we're Phils to Phoenix. Phoenix. Two countries. One heart. Welcome, Welcome to, to our, our chica kind chica. of weekly Chica Chica. Turn a little bit into monthly, but we'll, we'll get on that one. Yeah, we'll move a little bit. The, today we are in Werner's Field Park on our way to go get some groceries. With Mama and Papa over there. And we actually have some special guest stars in today's. Wait, wait, wait. Mama and Papa. Mama and Papa finally got here to the U.S. Welcome back. We are in. You let you read it and see it. Say it. I, I want to see this one. Werner Parks. Werner's Park. Werner's Field Park. Werner's Field Park. Okay. I, you actually did outstanding on that one, so. Okay. And we have special guests over there. Oh my Papa. Okay. We're actually heading to go to groceries, but before that, we'll give you an update on what's our life, what's our happening. <laughs> yeah, we're it's ter- been a month. So. Yeah, we're terribly sorry about not posting, but in the meantime, the I got back preparing for citizenship. Oath-taking. You managed to do your oath taking, and I got some video on that, not quite as he much got, as I'd like. He got sick. Yeah, I got horribly sick, sick for about for three, three weeks. weeks. Yeah, and, and he lose weight too. Like yeah, the good part on that one, I did lose about 20 pounds. 20 pounds. So. And I'm actually managing to keep it off so far. Yes. And so that's, then helping uh, Mama and Papa, Papa with, with the getting interview. Their, getting with, their interview done. And obviously they got the... They're here. The visa got approved. The tourist visa got approved. And it's a 10 years uh, multiple entries visa. And... We picked him up. <laughs> we we went to the, we rented a van and went to L.A. And it's like over. It's 954 miles. It's close to 1,000. Yeah, we we put on like 954 miles that weekend. Yeah, we went stop in San Diego, explore kind of explore San Diego, and meet up some of my friends. But that was really cool. That uh, one of them was actually a high school, uh, elementary, elementary and high elementary school, school friend yeah. that Mama and Papa knew. Yes. So it was kind of a, not quite family reunion, but a, a really neat reunion. Yes, that I met. It took like 16 years or 17 years for I met her again after high school graduation. Imagine that? Wow. And then... But you two had kept somewhat t- in touch on Facebook, right? Mm, no. Not really? No, okay. Yeah. yeah, it's a long story, but yeah, we keep in touch for some other times. And then we just, uh, Mama and Papa helped us get ready for graduation. Yes, I and officially graduate of MBA. Master's yeah. in Business Administration, major in accounting. I don't know if it's really major in accounting. I can count one to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> but life is finally starting to kind of get back to normal. We're yes. starting to get a pattern back in. So we should be able to start doing this on a more weekly basis. I'll try to write up, but uh, one thing I need to finish up and clear up is I need to finish up all the books and records for the Jack Harris because that's killing me some days and I need to focus and finish on that. <laughs> and the, you're going to ask for yeah. someone else to come in and do it as of January? Yeah. So. Right now, I need to like clean up everything for the past two years because when it was moved to me, I didn't realize that they still want me to finish up the past year, and I, I need to do it. So, anyways, it's okay. It's good. It's interesting. <laughs> but what we did also, it's just a lot of things happening. So I'm just super excited. Finally, my brother also came. During my graduation, your sister also came over. My sister from Washington came in, and your brother that's in Florida right now, Orlando, managed to come over, so that was kind of cool. Yeah, it was like a lot, and then we have a small uh, party at the house with just Filip- my neighbors, the Filipino neighbors, and the, you know, the people close to our heart. But there was 15, 20 people came? Yeah. And that was actually a lot of fun. and. We had food for a week. I know, I know. <laughs> like I told mom, and now I'm starting writing down like our groceries in 
now I told John, like going to Asian store is a mass. It's a mandatory <laughs> now because my parents love vegetables. So I need to get some okra, some taro root, some Philippine egg, eggplant. elephant eggplants, so those kind of stuff that we still, we will go to American groceries. There are some or a lot of things that we will go there, but there are also special things that we need to go to the Asian store. Yeah, every couple of days it looks like we're going to be going to the Asian store. So yeah. that, that's actually kind of cool though. It's and good. And my diet is like going back to, I've been losing like way too pounds so now and it's good because like because i've been eating the food that i used to because yes. you know what i mean it's good for me getting back to more not quite a true filipino diet but a more filipino diet yeah it's just small portion because when we go out instead of me eating out the entire portion i have like two people we share like two meals like you know yeah the three of you share two meals yes and unfortunately i still do the american thing and eat an entire meal by myself but no <laughs> We're improving sharing. on that. We're getting smaller meals. I'm getting smaller meals at least. Yeah. So I'm overall I'm excited. I'm so happy. That we're also starting to do a little bit of day tripping on weekends. Yes. The yesterday we went up and we tried to make Flagstaff. <laughs> but uh, we wound up doing a lot of uh, stopping. unexpected stopping on but, the way. And but Mama and Papa enjoyed it a lot. Like, you know, they were so happy, they were so excited. They see different perspective of that, uh, the Arizona desert and pine, having pine trees, fall colors, uh, the fall colors, and the big rocks. Um, they were so, so happy. Mama said that her heart is so happy, you know, made her happy heart, uh, uh, you know. So it's like, it's, it's like fulfilling as a, a daughter. Her eyes were full too. Yes. <laughs> literally like literally translation you know like busog akong mata you know that's the literal word that she said <laughs> but uh it, it was it was kind of cool that yeah. we got to see a lot of the leaves changing that's true uh with the elevation and the 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 little bit of climate difference it's probably two three weeks behind where flagstaff is yeah so we got to see a lot of the leaves that were still green and the the trees were in a process of changing so you had a mix of the green and the yellows and then we see some of the reds too how i wish like we just like stopped in that one part of fresca that i see those red leaves too. i missed those all together yeah. that there there may have been a uh, there must have been a tree or two but yeah two or three i saw like but it was overall a really beautiful like so expect to start seeing some Good. road trip videos with showing mama and papa a lot of the new stuff and yeah. i need to start getting getting back into the habit after taking such a long time off yeah. of taking the camera with me a lot more and yeah one also good news things that um that we received or showed in the mail yesterday was my u.s passport <laughs> Somebody was horribly excited on I that one. I was so excited, like, like I checked my grade and everything, and I, I saw my grade, on my, you know, my grade, and I'm winding up having migraine because I'm like, what's wrong? Wound up on a happiness overload with the, and ended up with a migraine. <laughs> I'm like, what's going on? Like, I was like seeing the beautiful leaves, and like, suddenly in the evening, I'm like, oh my god, I could not. <laughs> But yes, that was really like an experience, a joyous experience. That, uh, <laughs> yeah, that was actually really cool. And now this spring when the consulate does its outreach, yeah, we can reapply for dual citizenship. Or she can reapply for dual citizenship. For American. American. No, I'm American. <laughs> I have a oh, Filipino passport. Uh, well, you said yours needs to be renewed anyhow, so... Yeah, I need to renew it, so... Jewel and renewal of passport, because the expiration date will be next year. You can renew it a year early? Yes. Would it's... it be any easier to renew in the Philippines? No, it's easier here than in the Philippines. Oh, okay. <laughs> a lot of things are easier here than in the Philippines. <laughs> yes, that's true, so... 
and, and that's something that's kind of kind of funny watching through mama and papa that uh that's true and then so we hopefully we will be back going to live streaming um you know putting it back on uploading with us uh yeah we got papa and i got our marching orders that we need to start decorating for christmas yes that we'd had a uh agreement in place <laughs> that the first weekend basically labor day weekend We'd decorate the inside of the house, but the outside had to wait till after Halloween. Well, Halloween will finish next week, so now you need so, to double effort. Yeah, so I, next weekend or so, we're going to need to double down on this one and, and well, decorate have Mama the inside and, and out at the same time. Grass, so. So. <laughs> Look forward for that. We will take some videos. So you have a lot of short clips and try. And I'll make sure I know where the hooks are so you don't have a meltdown this year. <laughs> Oh my god, I cannot forget that. Oh my god, it's been a year, right? I think I actually, I'm not sure if I got that because I tried to do a multi cam and it didn't work. And I'm not sure if I got a good video up of last year's decorating, but I, I think I got that somewhere on oh your meltdown over that. That was funny. <laughs> I cannot believe I do that. And I keep my you keep telling me we'll do this and I said no I need to do this no so we we found the ornaments obviously that they were big enough that we found and we knew we had hooks the tree hooks somewhere and, and we had a bunch and neither one of us could find them and she started just ripping through every stinking box because <laughs> I want to put the, the ornaments in the Christmas <laughs> she box. was not gonna rest until those ornaments were on that tree that night <laughs> You need to do that when I arrive. You need to like have the hooks and the Christmas, the ornaments ready for me to put it with me. Mama. Yes, we do. Okay, I'm so excited. Papa and I will get that ready. And I actually got a four by eight sheet of plywood that I made uh, a table out of. Yeah. That I've got a pretty elaborate Christmas village that I always used to set up. Yeah. But when I moved into this house, that there just wasn't the space for it. That it, it takes the full four by eight sheet of plywood to, to put up. And our house, our house just isn't that big to have some place where we can display it properly. Yeah. And so, unfortunately, it's going to go in the garage. But fortunately, it's going to go up this year. Yep, I'm excited for that. Yes, high five. So. That would be it. Yeah, and that's going to be our next little bit. Stay tuned. I promise videos will start getting posted. Probably going to do, I, I'm going to shoot for two a week. Uh, probably Monday, Friday. Hopefully we'll start getting to three a week again. Yeah. And take it from there. So stay tuned. More videos on the way. And a whole lot of adventures coming up. Mabuhai. Uh,